in terms of story, uh, we just went through the gauntlet of Alfheim yesterday. Uh, basically, Tyr seems kind of upset. Well, more than kind of. Uh, he, he very he seems to very much regret helping uh, Kratos and Atreus, which I can't really blame him at that point. But so he kind of stormed off and left us to explore. Um, the, assuming this is going to be kind of like the more free roam portion, so I'm expecting a, a side mission or a, uh, this game calls them favors. So I'm expecting that's what we're going to be doing here. We do not need to rush. We should see this desert for ourselves. Look, I know we can't trust prophecy, but I'm not sure we should just ignore what we saw either. Vulture's gold. We will discuss it back home. Kratos is bald. Spoilers. To search for the wounded animal you heard of. Uh, in search of peace, the beast finds only war. Its last breath of life atop the sands. Its last meal of gold beneath the bones. Okay, so we find what looks to be a very large set of bones. Really? Yes. Well, okay. that's where our treasure is. In theory. Anyway. Good. Yeah. Lead the way. He says lead the way as he's run ahead of us. The canyons. Actually, I need to be... Necessarily on the lookout, but I need to be looking for ravens. Set for the realm between realms. Fine, boy. Why? Harder to find, thanks to dwarven enchantments and Yggdrasil's very own nature. Hmm. Lucky us. All right, so that mechanic, very similar to the last game in that there are essentially, I don't even know, like cores that you need to throw your axe through and sometimes there's multiple and sometimes you have to manipulate yourself in very clever ways uh, in order to do so. So that mechanic has returned. Not really sure what that was that did for us, but as there doesn't seem to be anything necessarily in that cave. I don't like big open areas. It's making me worried. Oh, Sindri, never mind. Okay. <laughs> All right, so we can get a quest from him, or a favor uh, from him. One sec. Yes, I know an upgrade's available, and you don't need to prompt me. Oh? That's, uh, that's interesting. At your service. This axe just keeps getting stronger. All right, Leviathan Axe level three, which means that we also get new skills as well. I'll heat up the forge. Drink for the night? Uh, nothing yet. I'm probably gonna get some Woodford Reserve uh, after the first break. I was in a little bit of a hurry and uh, I did not get a beer in the fridge. So right now. I am, <laughs> I'm drinking, I have an energy drink from uh, this morning, basically. I, I kind of nurse energy drinks. This is a very manly pink Starburst flavored energy drink. This is what Amy delivered to me in the morning, so who am I to turn it down? But yeah, Woodford Reserve in about an hour water and energy drink right now because I need a little bit of caffeine. But yeah, that's pretty much gone. But I make it last the whole day. I don't really...
really think I want to upgrade any of this stuff. Uh, I still can't make decisions on, like, what I want to do, but... I can make decisions later. I'm just kind of, like, not spending my materials. Try not to break it. Really think I'm gonna break it? Atreus heard a creature in pain in the desert. Over a storm like this? Most impressive. You know Alfine pretty well, right? Do you have any idea what's out there? No, sorry. The elves and I. Long story, but it's best when we keep out of each other's way. Hive matter is stickier than I care for. Good luck on your search, though. Stuff some cloth in your ears to keep the sand out. Don't knock it till you've tried it. Secret of the Sands. Okay. There's our favor that I was expecting to uh, acquire. Goals. Find a way to reach the pained creature. Um, we can't do that yet. Can't do that. These are all just kind of, um, how do I want to say, like, long-term goals. There we go. What are these animals? Gulon, native to Vanaheim. I'm not sure what they're doing here. Hey, they seem to want to take us somewhere. I almost spoiled it, had to delete. Someone trained them to pull a sled. Lucky for us. Domesticated gulag. Dangerous games, rude. Dangerous games. Uh, push slightly to trot, fully push to run. So, basically, boat mechanics. Just faster. Any particular direction to find your wounded animal? Ah! Or are we just enjoying the weather? I can't hear anything out here. Perhaps we find a cave first to catch our bearings? How about I go straight for the bones because I know that's where the treasure is. Was so smart on that one question in Fallout? No, I wasn't. I... Was in the middle of... I was in the middle of working, uh, and also I just misread. Well, I guess we'll grab the treasure. I hear a raven, that's why I'm looking around aimlessly. The questions were all about the uh, Declaration of Independence, and I think the question that I got wrong was <clears throat> it listed out different parts of it, so there's the preamble, uh, the, the four options were the preamble, introduction, ratification, and indictment, and it's which one was not a part of the Declaration of Independence. Oh, my, uh... My sled dogs have rejoined me. Uh, what are you? The ravens are back. They are. 
And I won't say I won't say anything more about them. I just heard words, but I didn't understand. Uh, depending on which words that you heard, it could be completely different meaning. Also, exploding wretches. Lovely. <laughs> Never mind, getting too tapped. This is a fine mess. This is a fine mess. I was screwing up the timing on that pretty because I was stuck there. A jumping attack and just leaving me vulnerable. Oh, this is good. Just I'll just die now. Yeah, I'll just die now. Here, take out the alpha. Although he gets a friend now. Ow. You know what? The wee bastard's about to explode. He thinks no awful. I agree. You're dead. Then you're dead. That's not where I wanted that to go. I don't know if that was supposed to be. <laughs> you know, I'm not even going to question anything anymore. I am trying my fucking best, my, my boy. See, I'm fucking busy. Fuck. Hey, man. That was a good show. Are you patronizing me now, Mamir? Some of those double parries saved my shit. People clap? No. <laughs> Please don't clap for that. That's a goddamn embarrassment. So, which is your favorite of Gavassia's poems, brother? Why would I choose a favorite? So I don't know my favorite because I sold them all. <laughs> Belt of Radiance. Uh, well, let's have a look. 
defense. Uh, last second of aid activates realm shift, temporarily slowing down surrounding enemies. That sounds really nice. Uh, we can give up a little bit. Sure. Wait, does this... Yeah, this is the difference between gear level 2 and 3, technically, but we're only sacrificing a little bit of vitality. Uh, we have an accessory for... Lethal detonation. Uh, enemies killed from runic arrow explode. That sounds mighty nice. And skills. We probably have a little bit to spend here. Switch stances uh, by pausing momentary after any Leviathan axe attack. Once a new stance, press R1, R1, R1 to perform a sweeping combo. Sounds interesting. L1, R1, while barehanded, to quickly recall the... Leviathan Axe and powerful spinning attack. That is not bad. Gear level is greater than everything else, literally. I know. It's like we were so close to three, though. Permafrost is full. Uh, L1 and Triangle to consume the meter and activate. It's the Leviathan may axe melee attacks far-reaching waves of frost for duration. Thanks for your help today, V. Sorry if I frustrated. Not at all. Um, my only frustration was that I couldn't get through it quickly enough, <laughs> and I mean that in the in the way of I had to be like, "Hey, I gotta go." <laughs> Literally started studying JavaScript yesterday. Well, no better time than now, right? Hopefully, uh, you've been able to make a little more progress. Being super hard on myself. It's like it's like it's walking into a new FPS game and expecting yourself to be good at it. I'm sure you know, but... Actually, no. That's not even, that's not even a good comparison. <laughs> playing a new game, playing a new FPS game on a controller... That's a better comparison. I, all these attacks look wonderful. I don't know which one to use. <laughs> uh, let's upgrade that one first. And let's get the stance switching going. Uh, very, very Devil May Cry in terms of its uh, design. That's always that's a staple. Pausing during your combos in order to change that up. Press L1 and R1 while barehanded to quickly recall. Sure. Actually, we could just... Yeah, we could buy everything. Buy it all. Now I have to remember all of this, but... <laughs> we'll get there. Atreus, what can you do? Uh, bigger reverberations, applying stun. I mean, at this point, it's just... It's by all the things. Okay. Cool. Going back and forth with one of the teachers in the boot camp, like, do you seriously expect new coders to be able to do all this shit? Um... I don't know if the expectation is that you could do all of it. It's more... Maybe it's more, um... That you can think enough to... Or, or you can... One, you, you can either think enough, and two, you can, um... Like, they know you're gonna look up answers. I feel like is what I'm trying to say. So can you either learn it, or can you teach yourself the skills? Maybe I maybe I'm wrong in that, but
Alright, we are going to go toward the blue objective. Here's a Nornir. Yeah, that's what he explained. Yeah. Everybody just looks shit up. Everybody just goes to Stack Overflow or shit like that. Just feeling a bit incompetent. Uh... Anything new, it's going to happen. When you're learning something, you're not going to immediately be great at it. It's just... It's a fact of life. Like, part of my, you know, part of my education was programming. Uh, Alright, I guess we'll have to explore that later. Which is the only reason why I know it. I mean, I've kept up with it, obviously. It's, and it's also, you know, kind of what I do for work to a degree, so. But yeah, coming, coming in cold to... To programming in general, it's it's a lot. It's a very a lot of abstract concepts, and a lot being thrown at you. It's not so much the syntax. It's, and one of the other things I'm sure that you probably either heard or saw is that um, they say once you learn a programming language, you kind of know them all, and it's just a matter of looking up the right the right syntax. That's kind of true. Can I hit all three of these from here? Yes. I don't know what that opened, but it I did something. Designed so we just barely can't reach it. Damn you, Santa Monica Studio. Okay. So that clears the way to the chest, but unfortunately that does not clear the way to do anything else. So what am I missing here? Also, this looks like a totally accessible cave, but I'm sure it's not. Just window dressing. And I can't climb this, so... Hmm. Gotta be a way to get to this, right? It seems so simple. Hey, just climb the damn thing, Kratos. Say, where's my sled dogs? All right, we'll come back to this. Also, I see a raven that needs to die. This shit again. I can't see, damn it.
All right. All right, so the big boy doesn't come in. He's just creeping around the corner. I see that shit. I can't see you, but I, my auto, my auto lock on can. Left side. God damn it! No, no, no stun lock, please. Thank you. Ah, it was greed. As soon as you get blinded, I remember. I remember uh, the what well, might have been the, the Dark Elf King from the first game. He was a real asshole. What? That shield bash didn't hit? You're kidding me. I'm so sad. You could shoot him, Atreus. You know that? <laughs> You're not locked on. Sometimes he's just like, nah, I'm just going to shoot off into the distance. All right, two treasures here. What do we got? What's that? A diagram for a sword hilt. Perhaps we should show it to one of the dwarves. They'll know what to do. Gauntlets of Radiance. Well. I guess it's time. <laughs> We're sacrificing all of our extra vitality for strength. Which we die in, we, we, you know, we die in a couple hits anyway, so I, you know, it may not matter. More gear level. Whatever this thing is, I think the animal's inside. Whatever's inside is kicking up quite a bit of sand. 
That's the spirit. I mean, I've, I mean, I already die enough. Uh, what did you just say, Mir? Caves and tunnels, something. So much sand. I don't think we're getting through that gate in this storm. Okay, so Atreus can open that later. Um... In theory, I should be able to hit both of these, but maybe from outside. Dwarven Steel, okay. I needed that to upgrade uh, the other set that I have. to go down into the cave it would appear also we happen to clear the yeah we couldn't possibly get rid of the sand that's impossible and or illegal look there's a cave entrance what was in the canyon desert is the creature within yeah sounds like it we'll find it if we keep going what is this place a refuge for the dark elves by the looks of it one of the few remaining now that they're barred from the temple <sighs> great and the below <laughs> well on the nose for the name but you know what sure Just making sure I didn't see anything. asking the question like or at least I'm asking the question like why am I murdering or why am I thro throwing something that can fly trust me it works somehow
I say that's a whole lot of uh, something in there. <laughs> All right, fine. If you're just gonna back away from me, then I'm just gonna do this. Shit's pissing me off. So I need to be a little bit careful at the end of that. We're the assholes. Patience. A virtue or a threat? Depends on the reader. <laughs> Almost everything you do feeds into some sort of a reward system. Which is nice. It's not just lore for lore's sake. There's definitely a way to overdo that sort of thing, but it hasn't really felt like too awful yet. Um The creature you heard. Yeah. What does it say now? It's not always like that. Some animals are just I feel what they're feeling, you know? And whatever this thing is, it's in a lot of pain. I see. Why do you ask? I am curious. Really? I am capable of curiosity. Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, I can't throw while I'm doing that. So I almost need to be more to the left. Doing that opens... What? Oh, I'm still in combat. Above you. Watch out. Can you shoot at the nightmare? 
Thank you. All right, there's one. There's the second one. Don't want to go too far. Feels like that might be another combat arena. I could be wrong, though. I keep hearing little uh, animals and such scurrying about. Oh, this is one of those. Oh, I mean, yeah, I know what I need to do here. You're just not going to pop up? I perhaps at the wrong place. What are you doing, Atreus? Other than teleporting to me. Okay, so if I'm touching the ground at all, uh, that thing runs away. Got it. Well, that only leaves like two possible directions. Did that not hit? I mean, I know the line's not blue, but... Still think that should have counted. Rare crafting materials. And do we go up or is this a side path? Or is this where we came from? This feels like main path toward that. Trying to explore as much as I as I can here. I guess we'll go up. So we're still looking for the other two um, bells or gongs for the Nornir chest. Is that a path back or forward? The map's really not. 
The map's really not much help here, unfortunately. Alright, so before we came in this door, there's a one here. There's one on the outside. And where is the third one? trying to figure out why you'd help some random animal. Is this not what you want? No, no, it, it is. I'm just surprised it's what you want, too. Okay, there's the third one. So can I open? Okay, there we go. Okay, so one, two... Three's in the tunnel, so. And that's where we're gonna go after. <laughs> Can I hit this from here? Pretty generous on the timing. I thought I'd be way quicker than that. We're in a blood mead. Yeah, that's where we came in. Come the flunkies. Just peachy. <laughs> Tried to shield bash, walked into the explosive instead of hitting the enemy. Got sniped. The domino effect. 
Well, got it on the way back, I suppose. Blocking my man. It's even worse when you can't see. It's almost a guaranteed death. Unless you're able to like perfectly listen for their attacks, but I'm not at that level yet. Wasn't a bad start though. So we have that in our in our back pocket. I'm just going for the flunkies then. Oh, my uh, Spartan Rage was done at that point. Those shots I don't know if I could parry. Like kind of one of those things that I don't really want to particularly test at the moment. Oh, I'm just peachy. Fuck you. Ready, set, go. Good luck. Are you sure we're doing the right thing? No. If you wish to abandon this creature, we will leave. Well, no. I don't want to abandon it. But if we have to kill a bunch of dark elves to get there, 
I remember a young lad who, until this very moment, would take on an army of Draugr to save a wounded animal. But these aren't undead Draugr. They're elves. I just want to make sure we're not repeating the same mistakes. Getting involved where we shouldn't. Is he learning? Maybe. Not the right angle for. Oh, never mind. I feel like I've gotten a ton of crafting components here, especially for um, armor that either couldn't upgrade before or either weapons or armor that I couldn't upgrade before. Or not weapons, attachments. Excuse me. On your left. Oh, they're being watched. Done. We need to kill all of these in one go. Not two hours stressful fucking jump puzzle. But this is basically Celeste Knight. <laughs> there are worse things to take inspiration from. Yeah, as soon as we recall the axe... Oops. Answers right in front of my face. Works really well in some places. Otherwise, I mean, I say, I imagine in others it's just pain. Drags us around trying to rescue animals. Why do you care so much? Is there something you're not telling me? No. Okay. <laughs> a lot of Celeste esque pinpoint precision, but most puzzles you could feel pretty quick. That's good. I've restarted the, you know, the the trials of Celeste. I saw somebody else playing it and streaming, and I was like, you know what? It's worth a revisit, especially since I never played the DLC. Bow and arrow, you can teleport to the arrow. <laughs> well, I know that strikes your fancy. So many jumps are jump, dash, arrow, teleport, teleport, arrow, jump, dash. <laughs> I 
Yeah, it's either trial and error or luck. <laughs> You'll get it eventually, though. I knew it. I knew it. I heard the sound. That was just failure on my part. can hear you. What? Did I, did I kill it? Hold on. I gotta make sure I didn't miss anything here. I don't feel like I did, but gotta double check and kick. Access that. Okay. We're good. Another all the other difficulties, I'm sure it's just mean. It's not an insta kill like that, so it's like Yeah, I took a lot of damage, I'm screwed for the next fight, but that's like, nope, you're dead. of the sands. They don't normally sing like this underground. Is that what's causing the storm? Aye. Judging by all this hive matter weighing it down, it's been trapped here for dozens of winters. Don't worry. I'll get you out. What is that name? Well, the last squid thingy we saw was Diener, so... Oh boy. While I appreciate the attempt at humor, that little brother is truly awful work Oh, well, can't all be winners. Get ridiculed. Wait a minute. A pun so bad, even Mimir couldn't shake his head. <laughs> he was trying to be cool. Looks like it can move now, but it still can't get out. Much of the hive matter is gone. We can free it from the surface now. Why did they trap it down here? Hafgifers are known to burrow, so I hesitate to place full blame on our dark elf friends. But it's trapped in their hive stuff. Hive matter doesn't belong to the dark elves, any more than the light belongs to the light elves. It's just another of Alfheim's natural resources, one the elves have used since the time of their ancestors. And while the light elves seem keen to banish the hive over on their side, the dark elves make effective use of it out here in the barrens. So, by clearing out all of this hive, are we hurting Dark Elves? You wish to leave the creature enslaved? No. Then let us free it. Let's just lift the ocean, Dad. Why not? Precisely. Say knock knock. Mm -hmm. 
Whispering Slab. Alright. Shoulder Straps of Radiance. Well, we may as well just go for the full set at this point. It's just, it's just better than everything I have. Not even going to think about it. Here. Yeah, let's do it. It flies? Of course it flies. It's a half goofa. Sounds much happier now. And hey, the storm's gone. Aye, perhaps we'll finally earn some goodwill from our dark elf friends after all. Look, Father, thanks for bringing us out here, but you don't have to do this kind of stuff just to keep my mind off Ragnarok, you know? This was not a distraction. No? Then why are we really out here? Have you ever considered? He just wants to spend time with you, lad. While he still can. Really? We do not know what lies ahead. But if Ragnarok approaches, I wish to enjoy the time we have left. I a what? A half -gifa. I don't know what to say. <laughs> Thank you for bringing us out here. That's what Mimir calls it. This is the codex entry for it. <laughs> We did this. As am I. It's a wandering vagrant, damn it. <laughs> Alright, so all the sand that was blocking things should, in theory, no Something longer be an I'm issue. I'm not sure I quite understand. In the Ragnarok prophecy Odin knows, all the realms get destroyed, including Asgard. In the version Groa kept secret, Asgard still falls. Wouldn't Odin have tried to prevent it either way? What difference did her life really make? I think of it this way. When it comes to subverting prophecy, knowledge is power. Without the full picture and context, the finer details can lead you to tragically incorrect interpretations. Enough. We will continue later. So there's a chest that I couldn't get to earlier just because of because of the sands, so that should no longer be a problem. Now where's that third brazier? I know I've looked around this two or three times. <laughs> oh, it's up there. How the hell do I get up there? Ah, never mind. I don't get up there. This comes down. Or lights like that. This game has forced me to like learn how to actually type uh, like different uh or That's nothing, brother. different Just characters like Ragnarok has has the uh is the umlaut or whatever how do you pronounce it I had to learn the keyboard shortcut for every time <laughs> other than the, so I don't have to copy it and paste uh, point. which is alt 246 I want to say Ah! 
Yeah, I finally, I finally caved. I'm like, you know what? I can't just, I, I don't want to have to look this up every single time I need to type it. We were discussing how manipulating the details of a prophecy can wreak havoc on the believers. Back in my homeland, I was privy to the operations of a certain coven of heath witches who were keen on destabilizing the government. They picked an influential thane, an otherwise loyal man, and fed him a story of his own ascension to king. Old. We will finish later. And the other character, I forget what it's called, but... It essentially looks like an O with a line through it. Uh, right now. Okay. <laughs> this will be fun. Hear the Smiths every time. Oh. I nearly choked that away. <laughs> Reminds me of tales of a cruel empress, one too angry to die. We will see. That went from comfortable to like fuck <laughs> real quick. As is tradition. <laughs> yes, absolutely. So in order to um, sort of upgrade, in order to upgrade the Blades of Chaos, we need to continue doing that, or continue doing those. Got it. Here. A little while ago, you mentioned Odin's Raven. What's to stop him from using them to pop into existence and kidnap anybody he wants? Consent. The only way to travel by Odin's ravens is by your own choice. Hear that? Consent. Um, damage, stun, or frost? Let's do frost. Why not? Ha! 
not so bad then. Alpheim, two out of or three legendary chests, uh, three out of four lore, two out of three art. I forgot that the menu tells you all this stuff. Still so much to explore. If, we, if we're trying to 100% this, which I, I don't think I will. As long as I'm getting enough of like health and, and rage upgrades, I'm pretty good. One thing I'm kind of um, I'm kind of stuck on is like the fact that there's you know the precedent has been set that Sony's going to release their third party or first party games on uh, PC. So I'm like, any game I'm playing on the PS5, I, obviously I want to play just because of. Of. Uh, well, I guess we'll listen to the Mimir story past. first. Hold on. So when they did, the Thane took it as confirmation. Next thing you know, he's helping matters along. He murders his king, sleeping under his own roof. Murders many he once called friends, too, thinking them fated to oppose him. Then, for a finishing <laughs> touch, the witches revisit this usurper. With just a few details structured ever so misleadingly, they convinced the fool he was invulnerable to all threats. Physical, Physical or magical. magical. Aye, aye. But twas not so for him. All turned into a rather magnificent bloodbath as they go. The Thane ends up without his head and a name so cursed none dare speak it. All thanks to a subtly deceptive prophecy. You really gotta write these stories down one day, Mimir. Well, I try. Jaws thinks he gets sore, but thank you, lad. And I lost my train of thought. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> uh, what angle do we need to throw at? That's for the end. Oh, yeah, anyway, so... But yeah, the fact that uh, games are going to come to PC eventually, and that's, you know, obviously my platform of choice, I, I feel very, like... I feel very discouraged to... You know, go for all achievements or platinum a game on PlayStation or whatever, because... You said souls come in four parts. Does that mean you can lose some of your soul? But not all of it? I. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Lose any one of them, and the entire being suffers. Still, sometimes luck alone is enough. Just ask your father. My success does not come from luck. Ah, the refrain of the eternally lucky. Ah! Yeah. If I'm gonna 100% the game, I feel like that's. I want that on Steam. Shouldn't be hard to save transfer if you choose. Well, it doesn't transfer the achievements, I guess, is my point. Not that I'm like in it. I'm not really like going for achievements, but I feel like even discouraged to, to try it. Then you use Sam. I'm not sure what you mean. Steam Achievement Manager? Something I've not heard of. Basically, the achievement lock on locker for end game idler? Ah. Maybe something to look into. Yeah. You can open the app ID for any game and make Steam think it's running with it. Like there's some holiday thing for Doom Eternal and didn't want to install it. 
Ah, okay. Brother, you ever think of cooking meat with those blades of yours? No. They would foul the meat. Oh, because of the magic on them? The blood. Ah, yes. Carry on then. <gasps> Yeah, that makes sense as a concept. I just wish there was just an easy way to transfer stuff. Like, hey, you achieved this on PlayStation. Here's an easy import tool that you can use to grab all your stuff and get it into Steam. Can I do a recall throw, maybe? Yeah, if I would 100% this on PlayStation, I'd just transfer, download a copy and go. 100% copy and go. It's not either. I don't see a reflecting. Uh, I don't see a reflecting stone here either. As far as I'm aware, there's no way to get above this. Comes back on like the right side. Not quite. There you go. Don't know what I was supposed to do it that way, but it works. Oh, gotta remember to ask Tyr about his travels to the lands beyond the seas. You wish to travel the world? I don't know. Maybe. See new places. Oh, the Temple of Light, we missed a chest. Damn it. <laughs> There's so much. There's so much to look through. We can't really fast travel any of this, but it looks like we've gotten most of the stuff of the Barons. I guess maybe there is a legendary chest underground, or... Gotta be, right? Find out more about myself. Hmm. Anytime, Atreus. Anytime. <laughs> Alright, so that was just lore. Um... Nothing, nothing here. Can't seem to do anything with these, but th this is the second time I've seen like a headstone sort of looking thing. So I, I feel like that's gotta be something for later. Did we go in this cave? I think we did, right? Yeah, we did. But it goes much quicker when you've already killed all the enemies here. Mimir, you were talking about how Fenrir's soul is headed for the light of Alphon. But that's because he was a wolf, right? Aye. 
Were he a god or a human who died in battle, a Valkyrie would have taken him to Valhalla or Folkvonger. Had he been a human or god who died outside of battle, he'd be cast down to Helheim. Yeah. But Fenrir was a wolf, so his soul will join all the others in Alfheim. Like mothers. Yes. Like your mothers. Surprisingly somber bit of conversation there. But yeah, just thinking a little further on the achievements thing, it's like they don't want you <laughs> they don't want you to transfer because that means you're not playing on PlayStation. At least I would think. One artifact, one chest. I'm not going to look too hard for it. I just was, wanted to do a little bit of a sweep. And if I don't find it, then so be it. Father, can we build a lyre together? The instrument. Why? We hunt, we train. Those are the only two things you do to distract yourself. They are not distractions. Oh, of course not. I just thought it'd be nice to learn some music. You could teach me, and... No. It's stupid. Never mind. I say, can Kratos actually play? I don't know if that's been established. Yeah, we went through this whole area, got that Nornir chest. I don't know if we went this way or not. It's all kind of blurring together at this point. I don't feel like we did, though. Or is this just where we... Okay, this is just where we came in. All right, we did the whole loop. Uh, however, I see something else. Need to be able to. Oh. Sort of a heart. There's our I artifact. Beautifully, you know. I do not, and would prefer it remain that way.
We can't hit this from the outside. At least, far as I'm, I'm aware. And as soon as we, um, as soon as we recall, of course. Must be something I'm missing. Especially since it's enclosed like that. So either this is blocking something or... Right the first time, I just didn't time it properly. I had the thought of like, what if I grab it in mid-flight? What of them? Why don't you just throw them away? I see the way you look at them sometimes, like you're, I don't know, like you hate them. Even hateful things have their uses. Besides, I tried. They came back. They came back. We can upgrade their fury. Uh, decrease Spartan Rage cost of each attack. This seems relevant to my interests. All right, so we've done everything other than the undiscovered things, which is great. So we've completed about half of the the barons. The real question is, do we want to go back to, like, Spartalheim and, and clearing that out before we go any further? Which might make sense considering today's stream. Also, there was a gate uh, somewhere in here. Not there. Ah, there it is. Something Atreus could interact with, basically. Looks like a lot of the sand is cleared up. But there's another storm out that way. I think that means... Another half, Gufa. The chisel will not open this. Did the lighthouse put this lock here? 
Why would they care what happens in the Barrens? A fair question. But until we find the right key, that poor half Koopa will have to continue its war. Okay. So basically, come back later. I knew Sinji was a great blacksmith, but this magical shield it just feels natural. The shield is well made, but it is you who wields it with skill. Thanks. Compliment? Going soft on me, Kratos. Worth visiting the Raven Tree. Probably. It's another thing we can do. Your stories, give them here. Huge man. Would have been a shame to have left that behind. Whatever you need. Slash forward three waves of light that deal increased damage uh, against the enemies afflicted with Sonic. Well, we don't have the required item, but nice to know that we can get it. And Atreus? Got all these beast scraps, so may as well. And... Tasteful. Okay. Kratos? Um... Have we more to talk about? We do. Want something in particular? Dwarven steel ain't out of ten. We can get that. Or that. Huh. That might be my best piece yet today. Very good. I keep exiting the menu like an idiot. For I've where I remember to sell all this stuff off. Explains the uh Sam. Whatever you need, I'll create. Spalders of Enlightenment, all runic. Probably same thing. Yeah, we can certainly craft all of these things, but do I really want to? Is the is the real question. Also, the dwarven steel seems like a, it's a limited resource, so. Oh, got time to chat? Perhaps not. All right. We're gonna check the Raven Tree and maybe go back to Svartalfheim. Knowing my luck will get something for it, like that's better than what I have. <laughs> oh. Dug up some new blueprints for you. Thanks, Brock. Like the father of all, we swung from the tree. Wisdom gained father. Servitude gained we. Swung from the tree. What do you suppose that means? In life we hanged. In death we kneeled. Until you freed us with your seal. So destroying the ravens free their spirits somehow. Good to know. Free? Well, free of Odin's control anyway. I mean, they seem to <laughs> don't. They seem to not want to deal with Odin, so I can uh, I can help with that.
damage that the burn status inflicts. Sure, wasn't too much of a additional cost, plus we're on our way to No refunds. <laughs> Damn it, no refunds. So we're well on our way to getting more stuff anyway. So yeah, I think I think we'll revisit uh Spartalfheim if I can. Yep. Uh I'm thinking Watchtower. Um there's one uh area that's kind of shrouded over there to the right. is coming you're gonna need to stop it's definitely nice that uh oh, luckily i'm offering new items it's definitely nice that the, the travel system is like that much faster oh what that guy's was huge yes it should lead us to the key for that watchtower door oh Also, submerged chest. Interesting. Father, what's the biggest thing you've ever fought? I do not know. You can't remember? Titan? Why do you ask? I don't know. So we can compare? It is not a competition. I mean, not yet. I'm not sure where that geyser was. I admittedly was half paying attention. Sold that raven over there. But I believe, I believe this is the, uh, no, <laughs> I swear it was like left side of the touchpad for map. Then I hit the left side of the touchpad and it's like, nope, you're going in the menu anyway. Father, look, we can chisel through this door. Glad to see that still works. It's not an entire mini game this time. Nice. Perfect. Nice. Oh, that's all was here. Well, that's pretty underwhelming, I must say. Raven tier gauntlets, uh, Chris healing, Hellstone's rage and gear. Yeah, it's kind of, kind of better. Two points less of strength, but also grants luck and. However, we get dodge slowdown when with the other set, so it's kind of nice. Can't climb that. Although it kind of looks like you can, but. Mimir, wouldn't you prefer to face forward rather than backward? We already tried. There were issues with Viscera. Oh. 
And there was a brief bit where I thought I might get used to it. He did not. <laughs> he did not. Um. Hello? Huh. Who's abandoned? I need to hit it properly. Easier to start with this one. Like this sort of stuff, worth it. Bay of Bounty doesn't say anything. Watchtower. And yeah, there's still a whole lot that we haven't done. This is itchy. I think my beard's coming in. Is it? Yeah, on my jawline. See? It's growing. Is it? Well, that's not just dirt. It's not dirt. I think it's just dirt. So this is cut off. So much stuff. Geyser, that's what we wanted. The key to that watchtower door should be on this island somewhere. The weight of change. Look over here first. Come on. Whatever. Fine. I'll just swing. All 
All right, there's got to be a fucking nest. So many wretches. Where they coming from? You don't say. I'm gonna punch the shit out of this nest. Sometimes I forget like the amount of exploration that was in the first uh first game. But I've definitely been reminded of it. Exterminator. The ground looks weak down here, father. Well should probably take care of that then. All right, that's just a shortcut back. Maybe that lift can help us get higher. It might be easier to break that ground from up there. Well, I broke it. How do I get the door open? Hey, what if we climbed over to the lift? So we can do that. <laughs> Oh, so you were really quick to give me that answer, Atreus. You think you could break through the ground from up there? Nah. Oh, hey. I should know better than to even try to ask why I did that. That's called a mistake. Break it. Oh, 
No, I know. I'm already dead. <laughs> this should be easy, and I'm making it more difficult by not uh, not backing off. Just shoot him. Amir, is this it? Over here? I said, what was I looking for again? Oh, watch that. Now we must head to that watchtower on the shore. What are you not saying? The mining rigs are not the only sin I committed in Sparklefein. Oh, good. I need new socks. What has happened? They're wet. They will dry. You know, I just knew you were going to say that. Then why did you ask? I'm really not sure. They will dry. Yeah, I'm sure they will. Damn kids. So it's it's it seems like it's a decent mix of What's that smell? Oh, hello Atreus. Good to see you. Of things that you could do now versus uh we have to wait for. Can you hear that? No. Thought I heard a voice. Let's keep going, lad. All right. Put the key into that lock, brother. What's behind door number one? <laughs> Can't even put a key in the door nicely. Just bam. Yeah. If you could give that drum a good loud strike. Do I want to? Kratos is now deaf. What? So that's the voice I heard. I'd hoped it would have escaped by now, but we'll need to free it from its restraints. All right. I uh, did not see that uh, coming. Rigs disabled, it seems a bit fresher out here. Not seems. Is. I. You're right. What is this? 
A Lungbocker. I captured it many years ago. For Odin? Yes. I thought it an imaginative and eye-catching way to earn his favor. It worked? That it did. This creature, you enslaved it. Aye. But why? Because I was young and stupid. And I didn't know what it was like to be chained in one place for years at a time, with nothing to occupy your mind but pain. I don't know if I'd call it an excuse, Mira, but sure. <laughs> Disintegrates. Oh damn, that was a massive heal. Um just to make sure. Did you just cut the rope? Right. You chained the fins too. If you could. <laughs> That's not the right tool for the job. Easy. Easy. That creature's heard it. But we're going to free it. But it will always be chained. You know that as well as I. Now for the other thing. There may be a way to reach it behind that collapsed debris. Hmm. Totally seems like we just jump for it, you know? But I'm sure that unlocks something uh, back at the beginning. So self-righteous. God murderer. <laughs> So Mimir's the only one who can read it, so... No. <laughs> Didn't learn a damn thing. Yeah. <laughs> 
Seems like an all will be revealed later sort of thing. There's at least two chests that we've passed up now. So you just refuse to pick a favorite poem? That's uncharacteristically indecisive of I have a favorite poem already. One from my homeland. Uh, you know what? Maybe from the peak we can shoot that. I thought I'd look down there, but I could be wrong. There's got to be some way to do it. Seems like we almost have to get there from this side, but that's kind of impossible. It's the elevator we came up before. It's like they intentionally cut off all the angles. I'm thinking back to the beginning, perhaps. Oh, never mind. This is, uh... Need to stop trying to overthink it. Source of oil for Odin's lanterns. Oil toward lanterns. Whatever anger you're feeling, whatever loathing toward me, it's nothing to what I've said to myself. Well. Pointless, probably. <laughs> Ness was hiding some sort of device. Nice. Well, I know of at least one other area we could use that.
Can we run and jump with it? Oh. That's a long axe throw. Yeah, no way. Let's get back to the boat. But hold up. I assume I can't climb with it. Oh, never mind. We can do this. Then we can open the other way to the chest. So give me another fire bomb, please. You never spoke of this creature. Does that surprise you? That an old man would be ashamed of the mistakes he's made. No. Alright, back to the boat, to the other dock. expired by now but apparently the Aesir couldn't even be bothered to mercy kill it once it was no longer useful we could kill it no not when we can save it I say you've already put this thing through hell good we can reach the tail from this gulf Still save this broken creature. I know what it is to be imprisoned like this. I can't just leave it. And if it is beyond saving, I don't understand. Let us continue. <laughs> He's trying to say if it's beyond saving, then we kill it. Pretty sure that's what he was going for there. it on the way back. Oh, no, not you bastards again. Yep. <laughs> I can't see when they're swinging through each other, okay? away for a moment. Yeah. 
You're supposed to kill the one that's on no health. Always more uh, difficult than we ever need to make it, but you know, we get there in the end. Opens where I was before in case I need mi I missed anything, I assume. Also, oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. There's a reason for that. We need to go acquire another firebomb. I was curious, I was like, can I still do that, even by one-handed? The answer is yes. Alrighty. Tail must be chained as well. Sliding down that rope should take us where we need to go. I bet it will. Why can I? Oh. Why can't I interact with that? Uh, we'll come back. Could totally be helping the whale, and at the same time, here I am just screwing around looting. High luck chance to grant a rage burst when parrying? That sounds kind of nice.
Uh, affliction also sounds kind of nice, except for it's just its stats are better. So maybe we grab that for right now. There, you're free. What's going on? Maybe it needs a little encouragement. Can you get me closer to its eye for a face-to-face, -face, Bubba? Uh, probably wants to die. Can we open this one? Yeah, I don't think we can do anything with that yet. We discovered it, so that's... That at least counts for something. The mining rigs. They're mistakes, Demir. But it's Odin's fault. That's not an excuse, little one. But thank you for saying it. Not Odin's fault. I mean, what are you going to say to the thing? I'm sorry. Blubbering beast. Shoo! It's not moving. Why is it not moving? It has grown accustomed to its chains. But. No. No, we can fix this. We just need to chase it off. Scare it. Something. There is no making things right. Only better than they were. the wind blowing on its face. I can feel it. May you provide some comfort. That's not enough. It seldom is. Well, we did a good deed, kind of. <laughs> there was a raven here, wasn't there? Damn it. <laughs> Why do you yawn? Force of habit, I suppose, since I don't sleep anymore. Although. It's far more confounding that I'm the tired one. I've seen you stay awake for days at a time without so much as a drooping eyelid. Not even a nap. Gods do not nap. Oh, tell that to Thor. All right. Where's that damn raven? I know I saw it. I was just too far away the first time.
I want to say it was like off the initial uh, place where we landed, but could be wrong. I'm thinking back this way. Yeah, okay. I can work with that. Maybe? Ah, okay. Totally missed that the first time. Everything's done on the whale. Totally saw a health pick up at the corner, out of the corner of my eye. I'm like, yeah, we should probably grab that. Also, the boat teleports depending on which uh, place you go. Which it makes sense. It's just a little thing that I found amusing. Brother, in my travels. Okay, let's. Uh, Ahead of a great battle in your homeland, at a place called the Gates of Fire. The Hard Gates. You are there? No. Is that regret in your voice? I did regret not dying there for many years, but no longer. Re did regret not dying there. <laughs> The compass gets confused quite often. Or it's like overly sensitive and snapping around. I don't know how to describe it, but it's just it just feels like it jumps all over the place when you're uh when you're boating. <laughs> 